And hello to all friends, Potatoes are with you. Today, we have a review of the card from the subscriber, where he built just an ultra ultra cool energy generator, where it is generated absolutely indefinitely, not only with the help of Cret, another edition, but in general this is not the point. I think that you also have this whole thing standing for a long time. Therefore, we look until the very end. But before you start watching, be sure to subscribe to the channel, like it, write comments, and also just be sure to click on the bell, so as not to miss new daily videos. But we're getting started. So well, I appeared near this kind of lighthouse. By the way, he doesn't give me anything for some reason, he was too lazy to do it. In general, there is a little book here, let's read it. Hi Potato, my nickname bot is not Ute, and this is my new invention. There is such a mechanic in Crete, that if a skiff with a hose is lowered into a large enough tank, it will extract liquid indefinitely. So, with the help of the Heat's Crafting Chance supplement, we can get infinitely and very powerful rotation, thanks to a furnace burner charged with lava, and it can be increased as long as you're still alive. So, there's something else we have on other pages. Let's see how you always like to do just a lot of pages and little text, there is nothing at all. 38 pages already, 40 and nothing. So wait, there was something. I have my own elevator, can I finish it or send it? Let's finish it, send it, if it certainly differs from others, and of course I'm sending it, because it's interesting to look at all the variations of elevators. So, something else like that. My friend and I want to build a factory, there will be a lot of systems and possibly decor in it. Listen, well, this is cool, so finish it faster and send it. We are doing all this, we will definitely look at it and admire it. And viewers need to subscribe, like, absolutely right. If you haven't subscribed yet, don't like it. I do not know what you are doing here, why are you watching videos, because the content is so interesting. I show you in each video, something new from you and, that is, your card show. I think it's definitely worthy of a like and a subscription. So then, let's consider what he's built up here. At first glance, this is quite some kind of industrial incomprehensible thing. Here, we have some magma fans, some fans, furnace burners, or whatever they are called, I forgot. Furnace engines are shorter, something else is moving, why is the engine on the engine? In short, let's figure it out. So, let's start from the back, yes, let's start from the back. In general, we have fame here. As he told us, this whole generator is powered by lava. This is where she just comes out. Well, yes, look here, she goes, goes and goes into these dispensers. So it's being mined somehow. So, look carefully here we have a pulley with a hose. So, why isn't it omitted by the way? So, and here, that's all it is omitted. Okay, so let's put it down. Yes, as much as possible. And that was Buck. In short, lava is pumped out of it. Apparently there is a source of lava there, and this skiff is recorded with the help of this fan. As I understand it, yes, we are strengthening here. The gain is 192, excellent, and it's all just going to power up here. And also apparently power up the pumping of lava here. In short, everything that is connected with the glory we have for this endless generator, in principle. The speed is not important to us here. The main thing is that it was simply pumped out, and the lava was delivered there. I think we won't have any problems with this. So here we have lava being pumped out again. Let's see what kind of tank we have there. Yeah, I see. He just set up a big piece of lava here for himself, and extracts lava. In principle, in principle, I think that if you search the world carefully, fly, you know, there are such huge lava sources from below. And I think that in principle they can come up. Probably yes. By the way, write in the comments, but if you find lava sources in the world, that are so huge, which are usually found. They are suitable for endless use, and pumping out lava or not, you still have to somehow do it all through hell. But because I remember, let's say that M's Pushkin, along with the Sock Hunter if you remember, he made an endless lava generator for us, which pumps lava out of hell. Which by the way is cool, so if you can in principle, resort to such a topic, and it will also go. In general, this lava is pumped out, pumped into a reservoir. We have 128 buckets stored here. The whole thing is pumped right here, but into dispensers. These dispensers, as I understand it, fill buckets, which are eventually pumped out with the help of this chute, and goes down. There is a burner here, just the same, the only thing we need from the supplement. Here, in general, is our burner, which is made from the stove. But in fact, as we already know, the scheme itself justifies a little more, but we can do it without any burners there, and on a conventional stove. After all, if we make a special mechanism that will sometimes pump ore and pump it out, so that in short it wanders back and forth like this and never melts, but simply activates the stove, then we can in principle limit ourselves to this and without any additions there. Therefore, if you do not have such an add-on on your server, if you play on the server, then you can do so, and it seems to me that it is not even very steamy. A little scheme to change and basically everything. In short, the empty bucket then goes down here into this gutter. This chute is powered by a fan that blows upwards. It blows up with us, yes, up there, and that's the whole thing right here, into the gutter, or rather into the funnel. By the way, look what an interesting inventory coloring it is here. A funnel that passes back up to the depot, 
and again we have everything in a circle, a cycle, shorter than a bucket in nature, filled with lava soul, and then like that, hop it all back, endlessly spinning here. But this thing is powered by another fan. Interestingly, the fan is powered by a fan. It's all a matter of magma, of course. In general, this is our first module, the second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh. By the way, why there are seven of them and not eight, I don't know, it's an ugly number, but in principle it will also work. In short, that's all, that's all we have. Where does it come out? So that's it. Here it comes out, then it goes down with such shafts, by the way, it's very beautifully done here. I didn't know that you can use such pilers. There is no pilara, what is it called? Shorter holders for pipes, also for shafts, because I didn't guess something shorter. Here we also have one holder, and the whole thing is compiled into a single energy, with the help of these chain drives, and goes to amplification. Of course, where else to go except not to strengthen? Here we have, of course, 256th speed. Much less, because well, why not? since we have as many as seven furnace engines here. And this whole thing we have is generating a huge speed of 256 revolutions per minute, of course. And a low load so far, well, naturally this is already as we load this whole thing, but here we have the remaining capacity of 114,000. When one of these things produces seven times less, how much is it? It's shorter somewhere 16,000, 20, 16 somewhere probably so. In general, I may have made a little mistake, but in the area of that, let's you know, just check how much load it gives, just just figure it out so that let's say one mechanical press. So we'll connect it here now, it gives us how much? So wait for 2000 loads. Yes, 2000 loads in my opinion. Yes, 2000 loads, and here, yes in short, he adds 2000 loads to us. That is, if we divide 114 by 2, it's somewhere like 50, even 55, 57. We can even connect presses like this here. And also let's say, well, Let's compare it with something that we often use. Here is a mechanical crafter. I think it will be a great example. So where is it located then? Can't reach it all. But our mechanical crafter is here with us. So you need to connect it, of course, through a gear. So the gear, that's our little gear. We connect here and connect one crafter. So how much does he eat from us? It devours just how 512 is written here. That is, you will be able to connect four times as many, somewhere shorter than 200 mechanical crafters in general. It's just like this. Well. A relatively small module. Naturally, this source and this pumping power will be enough for more lava feeding. Here, by the way, you could just see an excerpt from the process of how we are powering this bucket. That's shorter than all of this, you can really extend a lot, I don't know at least exactly twice and again, until you have a lagging computer. But, I think that with this configuration, where there are no trees, and everything is powered simply from lava, Nothing will lag, and everything will just be fine. Let's fast try to add a little bit of the same module here as he has. In general, I'm just doing this here, copying, delivering a few pipes like this. Let's count, even four pipes were installed here. We have put another dispenser, and here we are putting a depot with you one thing. Here is such a smart gutter. So op, op, here, here, then here, we put the stove burner in this way. The difference by the way, her texture is quite interesting. So, then we take this chute here. So. Let's copy it. Here's a smart gutter. Now here's an empty bucket. Here, we will have a funnel that looks at the gutter. That is, right here, here, up, like this. From below, we add two fans. So we have two fans, one of which looks up at us, like this, and the other looks down. So up, neat, everything is fine. He looks down at us. Then, we take the magma, here it is, and this thing will all need to be powered by a lever from behind. That's how everything was activated. So by the way, a small mistake, it was necessary to put it to the left, here here we have a pole that interfered a little, and I got confused. In short, we duplicate the whole thing again, here, here the fans are up, here the fan is down. Down. Great, no we're not looking down, now down. So, now the magma from below is here, and we are powering this case from behind. That's it, activated. Now we are doing the whole thing above. That's it, that's it. And here we finally put one funnel that looks at the depot. Now, almost everything has already been done, in fact, it remains only to add this furnace engine here. So they put everything here, perfectly put, and also the flywheel should be put here with this side. Yes, everything is fine with us here. Then we just take the vertical gearbox, we put it here. This is the whole thing being passed down from us. So up, one, two, three, four, five, one more vertical box, and finally, there are two more chain drives in the housing. As you can see, everything is very simple. It remains only from above, guess what? Just throw us a bucket. We just throw a bucket. Look up. That's it, that's all, we have it absorbed here, before that it refueled with lava, and an endless epic engine starts working. That's how everything is very simply being completed here. In short, 
The scheme is just a cannon. You could see right now how much we need. There are a few pipes here, then one dispenser on this burner here. Consider that this is the thing for all this washing. A little iron on the gutter. In short, there are practically no resources needed. Nothing at all. Even there is very little brass, literally just for a smart gutter, and these flywheels here. And now, plus how many so we had 114. And by the way, I also removed my glasses, fashionable glasses. By the way, look what glasses I have on me now. This is the skin that I have yucks redrawn. So where are they? Engineering glasses. We also put glasses on glasses. It turns out how many for six eyes. And there are no longer 114, but 131,000. How much is that? If I'm not mistaken, 15,000 more than it was. And that's how it all happened in just two minutes. Well, there was a potato with you. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, put likes, write comments. Also, just be sure to click on the bell so as not to miss new daily videos.